But I'd like to have you talk about what role technology has played in the last few years. Um, you know, we have a lot of students who play well in, in training. When, when you when you try to perform well in training, that makes you perform better in the, in the actual competition. So every little edge that you can gain uh, in training uh, with your gear, you try to it give you an advantage in the fight. For example, those shoes for me. When, when, I, when, when I fight, you know, I'm wearing shoes right now, but when I fight, I'm fair. So when I'm training uh, in the gym, you know, to protect my feet against like a cut or, or infection, you know, I need to wear shoes. You know, like I can step on the on the something and then get cut and get an infection. So I need a, I need a shoe that make me feel like I'm barefoot. That doesn't create any obstacles. It make me feel light and fast, like I am when I fight. So I think those, those shoes is, is the, 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 the perfect fit for that. So what are your thoughts on how far things seem to be coming when it comes to things like? athletic wear to help you guys as, as fighters and athletes? Well, we see in every sport uh, the record are getting beaten. Like in athletics, uh, the 100 meter, the record has been beaten by, by you know, different athletes like over the time. The athletes get better over time. I, be, I believe a big reason of, for that is a lot of the technology. That's, these shoes is an example of how technology can help an athlete perform better. Outside of the shoes, what type of technology do you like to uh, a lot of things I use, like uh, cold gear. Uh, you know, where I'm from in Montreal, it's pretty cold. And sometimes I don't want, I don't want to uh, hurt myself. You know, having a like a, a muscle uh, snap one of my muscle or ligament when I'm running. So I need to, to have something that is light for running because I run track. And something that's gonna keep me warm, keep my muscle warm. That the, 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 in the order that the, the heat, the heat in my muscle would not be dissipated. That would, would not be lost. So. So the other at that type of uh, also of gear that, that helped me in the training that keep me warm and uh, keep me able to perform. And all this if you give it the athlete an edge. These things didn't exist before, like you know this 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 is all new, like under armor made this, it's part of the technology clothing and it give an athlete an edge. And it's also more secure, so you protect against injury, you prevent injury, which is important. <laughs> I'm not too big in that, but I learned too much of the technology. You know, I, I keep that most of the technology for, for my training, you know, but I know what I do. You know, it's always funny to see yourself, you know, like, I, I remember I never thought one day I would have been there, but uh, it's always, uh, like, it's a dream come true for me. Sometimes I don't even realize it. It's, uh, for me, it's, it's too much to be true, you know. Have you ever played? I play with yourself? I, when I, I'm not a good, a good uh, video game player, so every time I pick the character, I lose. So I don't like to take my own character because I'm going to make me lose. So when I play against a friend, I tell my friend to pick me and I pick another guy. So I know I'll get my, my butt kicked. Do so you have a go-to guy you like to see get a butt kick when you play a friend? Well, normally when I know I'm fighting someone, so I try to pick that guy against me and I know I'm going to... My opponent will, will lose so he make me visualizing what will happen in the future. It will never keep me motivated, but I mean... I know it sounds stupid, but it's just a thing that I like to do. <laughs> what role do you feel this game has had in teaching and educating people about the intricacies of sports and MMA? That's a good question. I think it's, uh, it's mostly for younger people, you know, like uh, older generation. I don't think they're really, like, I mean, some are, yes, but uh, most of, I think it's mostly for the kids, you know. <laughs> Games uh, is good for the kids, you know, like, they're very into it. I think it's, uh, it's good. But you have to make sure, like, personally, if I would have kids you know, to play game, you have to go, go outside and do some sport as well. Yeah, you know, the big thing is games today are also getting people off the couch with connect and that kind of technology. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. So it's going to be a big shift this year with EA Sports and the first UFC game from them. What do you feel like that will add, having the makers of that in, that FIFA doing UFC video games? Will be you. Will help. Uh, will help. Uh, you see how the sport going. It will, it will reach another level. You know once again. And you'll still have to stick with the opponent and not you, right? Absolutely, because I'm, I'm a bad player, unfortunately. So I pick my opponent and I tell one of my friends to pick me. So that's how it goes.